this is Lisa. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. I'm great. I'm hot. And I've been out watering today. I thought I'd maybe come out today and do some updates on some things that I have growing that are doing well. Come along with me. I'll be right back. These are my peppers. This one is Belasia. And that one right there is Shishito. That one is a yellow bell pepper. And this is a California Wonder. Now the Malaysia has some peppers coming out already. It's really the one we I've never grown it, but I've heard that it has a really nice tasting pepper. I don't care for the hot peppers, so all I have are sweet peppers growing. These are um, the purple bell pepper, and then those are mixed, like red, green, yellow, orange. And my collard greens, uh, they've had it. That white moth has eaten them up, laid the eggs and eaten them up. It's my rosemary. It's doing really good. It's from last year, so I didn't ever move it. I just let it stay there. And that's my lemon balm. I also have lemon balm right there. My rosemary. I have a tomato. This one is a beef steak. I only put it in like a couple weeks ago. Or maybe. Yeah, I think it was a couple weeks ago. This one is that in-ground bed that we put in because we can use that bed over there with the ants. My okra is doing really well. My sister ate very much yesterday, like she said. And uh, I have some coming on. There's one right there. But uh, the back row the back two rows are Clemson Spineless, I think that's what it is. And then this third row to the front, coming to the front, are uh, red, burgundy, okra. I like those. You grew those last year and they're nice and they were tasty. And then the front row is a, a door tomato plant. They just make little small tomato, I mean um, okra. So they just make little small okra. But they are good. These are peppers that's red. And then California Wonder. And then this one is a um, banana. Pepper, those are uh, shishito, and then those, like those three are um, yellow. Is it yellow? No, they're orange. Orange bell pepper. And then this one is a red bell pepper. I got little signs, that's how I know. But I gotta get out here and clean them. It's been so hot. Today is supposed to get up to 100. I've already watered. These are my uh, cu cucumbers. They're all straight eight variety. They're doing good. I'm training them to go up this little trellis I made. It's a 
about six feet tall. So they're doing really well. This is my um, butternut squash. It's doing really good. I'm trying to keep it trained to go up this trellis. That one is my patty pan. And I think there is a vine board inside of the vine because of the way the bottom looks. I'm going to have to tend to that. Sorry about how it's shaking. Holding the camera. That is a pumpkin plant, plant. My sister has those planted everywhere and this one she cuts it back to make her tea every couple weeks and um, this one just comes back full every week it comes back like that one every week after no every two weeks uh, 14 days from now this one will look like that one. I mean, it doesn't take them long to grow at all. These are my bush. I think they're called aroma bush green beans. And they are putting out the beans. Gotta get out here and harvest some. We might get out here this evening before, just before dark. We pick some. My sister's already picked some. So they're doing really well. Those are still some onions I got left. These are sweet potatoes. And I got this net trellis for them to grow up. That's how I did it last year. These first two containers are uh, the um, slips that were started from just the sweet potatoes that we grew last year and then these we bought the slips they are boulevard we grew boulevard last year but we also had some other kinds so those may be boulevard I don't know but they from what we grew last year we got tomato plants I think that one is a Brema variety. And then we have a little basil plant in there with it. And these were only planted last week. Today is Monday, June 21st. So, like, not this past Saturday, but Saturday before that. So they haven't been here two weeks yet. That's another one. This is a super sauce. It's a Roma tomato. That one's a super sauce. Roma tomato. And it's basil. These are my leeks. And That's another Bremer tomato plant, and yes, it's basil. We have basil growing with all our tomato plants. So, and that's another Bremer. And yes, it's basil. Back there is a blackberry thornless blackberry. I gotta get me an arch or something because that thing is really taking off. Mm. It was infested with ants too. But we got rid of them. And then we moved the pot over here. I think those are zinnias. My sister had a thing right next to it. And then 
to have all these tomato plants. <laughs> I wanted to have plenty of tomatoes. And um, so I have plenty of tomatoes growing. So that's what I have today. School garden update. I didn't want to uh, make a long video. So I hope you all have a wonderful day. I'm going in. It's getting close to 100 degrees out here. I don't want my camera to fall apart. And all this heat. So you all have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.